Good morning, folks. Welcome, observers. Today we've got two excellent studies to report, one on pre-earthquake signals and another on the solar forcing of mortality, specifically related to tumor production. We're starting with the last 24 hours on our star, where we find a quiet day until just a few hours ago. There was no significant solar flaring. Coronal hole crossing through is minor. Solar wind and geomagnetic conditions are calm, but a filament did snap away from the corona. You might have spotted it incoming on the limb near the north over to the left. It will not hit Earth with this ejection vector, but it's a good reminder that sometimes it's not a solar flare. Sometimes the plasma rope just decides to leave the party. We probably won't get significant flares today. The sunspots are small and not complex. Remember, the Riger cycle upticks aren't expected until September and December. Hopefully, we'll enjoy some quiet until then. First up in the articles today is this one, yet another pre-earthquake electromagnetic signal identification. This time they scoped the top of the sky. Ionospheric activity in the E and F layers, those are way up there, but they still showed the vertical change in electrodynamic activity prior to the big quake. Still waiting for scientists to turn these thousands of studies into an early warning program. Top story today hits neoplasm formation and intensification, which means rapid tumor development and growth, leading to death among people, and found that the sun and its charged particle bombardment is responsible. This isn't the first time we've seen solar particle forcing tied to cancer, but it's a very detailed statistical analysis here, erasing all doubt. By the way, this is getting worse since the weakening magnetic field of Earth is letting more of these particles into the atmosphere. Folks, today is the last day to pre-order the new book. Probably won't have more available until well into next year. Grab one for you and as a gift for someone else. Christmas will be here before you know it. Here's the table of contents. Feel free to pause and read it. Space weather, solar forcing, and Earth's disaster cycle. I'll be signing every pre-order and they come with a PDF sent to your email when the books ship out in September. Folks, I'll be at the ranch tomorrow and Saturday. The self-defense portion on Saturday is going to be fun. Only a few people are signed up, so there's lots of chances for one-on-one -on -one time. We have so much going on the rest of the year as well. Check out the event list and book your stay at ObserverRanch.com. We greatly appreciate your support. We'll do this all again tomorrow. Right here, but right now at 6 a.m. in the new Valley of the Sun. Eyes open. No fear. Be safe, everyone.